ओके अब एक क्वेश्चन नंबर 11 देखो फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर 18 ऑफ एचसी वर्मा अ कॉनकेव मिरर ऑफ रेडियस r इज केप्ट ऑन अ हॉरिजॉन्टल टेबल वाटर इज पोर्ड इनटू इट अप टू अ हाइट h वेयर शुड एन ऑब्जेक्ट बी प्लेस्ड सो दैट इट्स इमेज इज फॉर्मड ऑन इटसेल्फ ओके वेरी इजी क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दिस इज योर मिरर ओके दिस इज योर वाटर सरफेस ऑफ हाइट h राइट एंड हियर वी हैव द ऑब्जेक्ट राइट सो वी हैव टू फाइंड द पोजीशन ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट सो दैट so that uh, the image is formed at the object itself now first of all let's look at the concave mirror so for the concave mirror if the object is over, uh, kept at radius of curvature the center of the curvature then the image is formed at the same point object and image are formed at the same point okay same thing we have to apply over here what should happen is that light is coming from the object it is refracting and then falling on the mirror okay so light is coming like this and again it should retrace its path okay again it should retrace the same path and go back to the uh, position of object same thing happens on the other side okay so light is coming like this going over here okay and then again retracing the same path okay going back and forming the image at the focus so a image at the center so this will happen when this uh, this is equal to radius of curvature correct okay that is because of these uh, this uh, refraction from water surface the object should form an image at the center of curvature of the mirror okay so let's say that so this is the water surface right this is your water surface now the object is actually kept over here somewhere here right so i'm keeping it over here okay and this object is forming first image at this point this image acts as the object for the mirror okay so the mirror will form the image at this point and that image will be again refracted by the water surface and form at the position of object okay so basically when you uh, go to uh, uh, see this diagram right so when you see this diagram so the water should refract such that the apparent image is formed at the center of curvature right so if this is y this is what r minus h so this is the actual distance of object from the surface of water and this is the apparent distance of object from the surface of water when viewed from under water okay when viewed from under water this is what will happen so for example i draw over here so uh, this is uh, y this is r minus h and when viewing from under water although the object is kept over here to the person who is under water the image will appear to be forming over here so this is the apparent depth this is the actual depth so in this case y by r minus h will be equal to 1 by n and is the index of water index of water is uh, 4 by 3 so this is equal to 3 by 4 in this case so uh, y will be equal to 3 by 4 times r minus h and the value of r and h is not given so we'll just keep it up to this so this will be your answer